Flowering plants undergo an unusual reproductive process in which there are two fertilization events rather than just one. This double fertilization takes place between cells reproduced in the male reproductive organs, the anthers, and the female reproductive organs, the ovule. The ovule contains a reproductive cell called the megaspore mother cell or megasporocyte. This cell is deployed 2N and undergoes meiosis to prepare 4 haploid N megaspores. In most species, 3 degenerates leaving 1 surviving megaspore. The one surviving megaspore then undergoes three rounds of mitosis to produce eight haploid nuclei. Cytoplasmic divisions do not immediately follow the nuclear division, so the eight nuclei initially shares the same cytoplasm. The multinucleate structure is called the embryo sac. Within the embryo sac, cell walls form between the most of the nuclei. Three cells, antipodal cells, form opposite in the micropyle opening of the ovule. Three also form near, uh, near the micropyle. Two are called synergids and the other is egg. Finally, two nuclei called polar nuclei remains together in the one large central cell. The egg cell and the single cell with two polar nuclei will eventually take part in the double fertilization event. Before this can happen, the male gametes, the sperm, must travel to these cells within the male's reproductive reach. To reach the embryo sac, a pollen grain that has landed on the stigma begins to germinate, sending a long pollen tube through the style and the ovary. A haploid cell called generative cell travels down the pollen tube. The generative cell travels behind the tube nucleus, which in nucleus of the large cell and makes up the bulk of the pollen tube and grain. The generative cell divides by mitosis to produce two haploid sperm cells. A haploid cell called... So the pollen tube reaches the micropyle of the ovule and digests its way into the synergids, releasing the sperm cells. The synergids degenerates as one of the two sperm cells fertilize the egg cell, producing a diploid 2N zygote. The second sperm cell fuse with the both of the polar nuclei fertilizing them to produce an unusual triploid 3N cells. As the zygote develops into an embryo, the triploid cell develops into the endosperm, which serve as the embryo's food supply. That concludes our understanding of double fertilization event in plants.